art and culture transcends a particular time. So the idea of a legacy, uh, an enduring legacy that extends beyond centuries is one that is possible through the arts and culture scene. Arts and culture have been hugely important to the University of Leeds. Our strand is looking to stimulate new work, whether it's poetry, music, painting. There is a move to reinvent a very rich tradition at this university, which is one of cultural fellows. In the 1950s, with the support of Eric Gregory, the university developed an, an intriguing and exciting series of cultural fellowships. The intention was for artists to work both with students and with the broader community, and also to get a sense of what it was to be working in a university. And I'm looking forward to the point where this new generation of cultural fellows can have the same influence on a new generation of students. What we have at Leeds are poets whose experiences, such as Tony Harrison um, or John Silkin, their poetry is rooted in that experience, in that identity of being in the North, being in Leeds. In its quality is international. So we can mix the local and the international. As a university, I think that's really important, that we have a distinctive identity that's rooted in our cultural history and in our region, and we can share that with international partners. Special Collections at the University of Leeds has world-renowned material here. We've got five collections that have been designated of national and international importance, and one of these is our literary archives and manuscripts. We've got some leading-edge stuff going on in this place. It's phenomenal. We've got the most incredible collection of uh, a, a first folio of Shakespeare, for God's sake. I mean, you know, and I've seen it. So that's the first time that his plays were collected together in 1623. That's incredibly rare. We have it here. We've also got a lot of manuscript material from writers such as uh, the Bronte family and Elizabeth Gaskell, and some really key 19th century figures. And again, this is the only place in the world that you can access this material. As we've seen from the history of the university, that new work that's come together here in Leeds within the context of the university has gone on to have national impact. It's had an impact on the cultural life of the nation. But we see this as the start of the revival and renaissance on one of the great traditions of this great university. What would make me proudest would be that we can replicate that history make our own history for the next generation. It's all about the creative process, which I think is fantastic and really hugely important in any civilization. The opportunity is there to create a legacy that is even greater than the one we currently have. Please do support our campaign. It's a unique opportunity. Do take it. Mm -hmm.